uh, the minister Juan Miller. I got to send this to Juan Miller because this is this is big news right here. Um, I'm all the way back here, and I know where the truck is. Where the truck is, is in the pond back there. Uh, Try to walk back there, but I know there's fuel all in those marshes back there, all along these people's property in America. They would have to buy these people out because we're talking about long time, long time diesel um, in the marshes right there. They got to dig out all that marshes, but that's a poison. So this company, uh, whatever they call there, but making all that money, they need to buy all these people's homes. All you need is a good lawyer, a good lawyer because uh, the smell of diesel what I can smell now. They got to dig down but 10 feet to mitigate this. This little dig digging on the surface ain't gonna help nothing. You're carrying out nothing. The diesel is still trapped in there all along here. All the way at 9,000 and all of, all, of, all of this was flooded. So you had the wind blowing this way and the tide of rain flowing down there. So that diesel is all the way down the road there. So you got a lot of digging to do. Um, the idiots and the asses that put a hole in that tank, they need to get, they need to be charged. They're charging me and locking me up and jailing me for doing video, for educating. But the ones that put a hole in that tank, they need to be jailed. They ought to know better. They ought to know better. Roscoe is right here with him. Um, he got to tell them better. Do not put no hole in that tank. Expert on fuel, but I gotta tell them, but look here, y'all don't put no hole in that tank. The tank flipped over, the truck flipped over, but y'all are adding insult to injury by putting a hole in that tank and letting all that fuel drain along here. Y'all hurting the community. We got the same thing by Shell. Nobody from the government, nobody from local government has told people and every other week, they, so much fuel is trapped on the ground there by Shell and Mars Java. They, they gotta take a break. They gotta take a break, come back, pump again. I ain't see nobody dig no hole to see how far the, dig, the diesel and Shell, then see how much fuel has escaped on the ground by Shell that has not been cleaned up by Shell uh, because they like kibbles and bit. They do it when they want to. And then you come on the 15th, they destroy all these people's homes down there. But these people don't know. They don't care. They don't realize that diesel is a poison. I can smell the diesel like I'm got a five gallon bucket and got my nose in it. That's so much and that's so serious it is. And when it gets into their air condition, it's gonna kill them slowly. It's a slow, painful death. Diesel poisoning. But Thai cash, they don't care. That's why they're here.